The Grenada government is observing its fourth year in office under the Keith Mitchell-led administration. As we look back on some of its accomplishments and achievements over this past year, we look at some of the projects that has been accomplished within the constituency of St. John. Nestled in the hills of the community of Concord is the beautiful Concord Waterfall. It's a major tourism site, but getting there has always been a problem because of the dilapidated condition of the road. An intervention by the Grenada government is making things a lot better. That, that's good. That, that's very good. The parking area is very good. With funds from the Basic Needs Trust Fund, the Pearl Dillamoth Child Development Center, located in the town of Guave, was renovated. Um, before, we had just the first flow, but now we have a second flow where we could have a complete baby section. This upgrade has resulted in major benefits for the center. In the past, we used to have 35, but now we'll be taking 50 plus. In the community of Grand Roy, a public washroom facility was renovated, providing a much needed service to the people in the area. Originally, it had just four toilets at the back that was being used, but it's been converted now into a male and female section. So at the back, we have three toilets for the male, along with a urinal. We have a male bathroom on the next side, a female bathroom on this side, and four toilets for the female at the front side. I'm satisfied with that new toilet in the front of the I just hope the community can stick up. You know? yeah. All so, right. You know, it could be comfortable when we come on the beach, you know? Somebody have somewhere they could use it. Whether it's 50 cents they could pay as a contribution, it would be nice. And I would like for the guy at Akertika, you know? So, you know, the past year always did. Because it's not the first time they come and figure this place, you know? And they keep blacking it up. So, I mean, I would appreciate that they care, care you know what I mean? A major achievement in the constituency of St. John is the construction of an over $6 million agriculture feeder road in the community of Clogier. Built by the Consolidated Contractors Company, this road now links two parishes together, St. John and St. Andrew. In 2015, the Hubble Bridge in Guelph collapsed, but a quick response by MP Alvin Dabrio and government saw its restoration in 2016, another proud achievement for his constituency. It was uh, very inconvenient, so today is a very happy day for me to see that uh, in such a short space of time, at least we could be walking across it today. Okay. So I think this one will be more stronger. Right, and we're glad to see that the work being done and we want to praise the persons for who is in charge of getting things done. And we a welcomed project in the constituency is the construction of a walkway in Hillsview, Guave. The path was more or less stones in a beaten down track, making it difficult for residents to get to and from their homes. Now, a proper walkway has been constructed. Ensuring an adequate learning environment for students is paramount for MP Alvin Dabrio, which is why he has been undertaking initiatives to assist schools with upgrades and donations, among others. At the New Life organization, NULO, a brand new cosmetology unit was donated to the school under the Special Projects Program. 